What's going on guys, Kyle Giger. We have the new Fire Flower Fairy Winter Cherry. As we see Ascension as HP attack, HP defense, and with it being fire, that means there's a new echo right here. Uh, normally, uh, the damage to vulnerable to fire uh, going up doesn't generally matter, but with the new fairy, this will matter. So remember 90%. Uh, when dealing damage deals extra AOE damage equal to percent uh, to enemies near the target. Enemies within the range share damage equally. Attack is guaranteed to crit. This is speaking towards uh, Lancer specifically uh, because they have their two big nuke AOEs. But if we take a look at the stats, crit rate, crit damage, block ignore, all the same. All you're getting is 8% max HP. I don't think this is going to look very worth it, but we will test it when it happens. Checking her out, I like her aesthetic with the kimono and the devil horns, different colors, I like the touch. Uh, basic attack, I always look at the basic attack, it can do different things. Uh, mistletoe, I believe heals you when she basic attacks. Then her passive, all of these what we're calling gen 4 uh, fairies have a passive that are very very strong. Uh, as long as you're on the current weapon that has Winter Cherry out, when the owner releases a skill or basic attack, the owner will have damage reduction within 6 seconds and will be immune to knock in the air, knock back, and draw effects. This effect is triggered once every 30 seconds, scales to at least 15%. And this sounds like it's going to be very, very powerful for something like Marksman because you can attack from a distance and this is effectively giving you a quick rigidity uh, which if you're also using rigidity uh, the downside of rigidity is that you have to sustain three attacks this is also a downside of god bless because you have to a certain amount of time has to go through in the battle to stack up your god bless and this allows you to get at least two stacks of god bless going so She's going to be very, very powerful, uh, especially for those brawler style where you are tanky, but you're also dealing out damage. Her active skill. This is such a cool ability. I wish all the elements had something like this. Uh, teleports to the area dealing damage and grants the owner flame, amp flame amplification and flame ability to the enemy hit. Flame amp. Increases damage to uh, things weak to fire by 30% for 6 seconds. Flammability. Whoever gets hit by this attack, they obviously take the damage, but they also become weak to fire. <laughs> Which, as you remember, up here, 90% uh, weak to fire. And then right here you get an additional 30%. Unfortunately, I didn't get this scrolled correctly, so I can't tell you how long the flammability lasts. I can't tell you if this scales uh, down below. Uh, it probably does. Uh, the biggest uh, question mark for me is how quick is the animation? How big is the uh, range? Just like if it's something like sometimes Primrose or uh, something like that where the AoE is generally a good size but it uh, it's hard to hit the target with this could be rough if your whole thing is built around a uh, fire bonus faded soul fire and then one shot somebody but I think this is a very very cool addition and I can't wait to check out winter cherry let me know what you guys think down below till next time guys